hope you guys are doing well and this is the second part of GSI and you guys already know I have already uploaded one video of what is GSI and I provided some basic ideas on that video if you guys haven't watched that video yet then have a look in the description and now let's get into the business so practically I'll show you right now how can we flash GSI in Redmi 7 and Redmi Y3 as well and before uh, we start just uh, mark my few words and this will work for you of course and remember that if you are going to flash android 11 gsi then you must need android 11 vendor if you are flashing android 10 gsi then you must need android 10 vendor remember that thing and if you are flashing android 11 and you don't have the android 11 vendor then you guys can use android 10 vendor but uh, most of the time it will not work properly so now let's get started and my device already booted into recovery so after booting recovery just uh, do always we do just dial big data cache system and vendor just wipe all the section and then just do a format data So clean flash is recommended otherwise uh, GSI will not boot and so many vendors are available actually vendor means you just need any custom ROM travel support custom ROM remember that thing and after that navigate to the folder where you have stored your vendor files so here is mine GSI MIUI 12 and in this video I'm just going to show you guys uh, MIUI 12 GSI I'm going to flash a MIUI 12 GSI so for that you guys can see here I'm using Moki ROM here is the Moki ROM and which is Android 10 and MIUI also Android 10 so that's why the GSI is Android 10 and I'm flashing Android 10 ROM and which is travel support ROM actually and you have so many custom ROMs like uh, Moki ROM, Lineage OS and previously Superior OS and so many uh, custom ROMs are available for Redmi 7 and Y3 you guys can choose any but I don't recommend you guys to use any GSA yeah, but if you are willing to test or if you want to check out how does it work then you guys can try out because GSA never stable so you guys can't use for daily life so now let's get it started first of all install vendor that means uh, the ROM you have actually we will use the vendor from that room just the vendor we will use so flash the room and and let it be flashed so you guys can see here the vendor image is flashing right now so we will use that vendor but we will not use the system image so system image is a gsi and which is that one and after flashing the custom room uh, so, uh, yeah, you guys will get uh, so many videos they will say to uh, delete data partition and so many uh, partition without vendor but I will not show you that process I will show you the very easy process so ROM already flashed you guys already seen that just now select the system image that means the GSI image and you guys can see here the dot img file that means image file and it's asking for the partition so select the system image partition as we are uh, installing a system image so that's why you must select the system image partition and now swipe to flash and it will be flashed within few seconds and wait for that so you guys can see gsi already flashed so we are done and if you want to reboot system then you can do reboot system no problem and if you have some fixes then you can flash now any fixes no problem and if you want to root then flash magics otherwise leave it so I do I want to root so that's why I'm going to flash magics so let me show you so here is the magics file just swipe to flash and it will be flashed within few seconds it's 
so almost done so we are done just click reboot system and your device will boot without any problem and if your vendor is not good then it will not boot and if your vendor is working perfectly then your device will boot and if your vendor is not good then change the vendor and try another room uh, another room's vendor file to boot your GSI no problem so here you guys can see the boot image actually the boot animation is working so GSI is just booting so no issue on that so this is the way you guys can flash any GSI so this is very simple process and hope you guys understand everything easily so if you if you guys uh, really like that video you can do subscribe and hit the bell icon and never miss the further updates so thank you for watching